warm winds. Welcome aboard, mate. Oh, it's good to be back. <laughs> Welcome home. <laughs> Seems like yesterday. <laughs> mm -hmm. Over a year ago. But yeah, you were you were one of the last ones on the boat with my parents just before lockdown. Uh, Everybody flew home and we, we so. flew, or we sailed Is here. Almost two years. No. Yeah, I think so we... It was a year ago, February. In Bocas. Yeah. In Bocas we left in a... Oh, yeah. two years. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, I think so I, fly, uh, I flew too much. You weren't even on board two years ago. <laughs> I flew too much. You weren't even on board two years ago. Yeah. Um. <laughs> <laughs> That looks like a different guy. Yeah. <laughs> Look like you're ready to go shoot some hoops. <laughs> Let's go. Once again. Yeah. Back, back on the lady. Back to be back. Welcome. <laughs> What's Maddie doing? Uh, the garnish of uh, the cheesecake. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Garnish for cheesecake. Nice. Uh oh, the magic suitcase is opening. <laughs> The SSL baggage. <laughs> T-shirts, cool. Ah, there's our new pillow covers for out in the cockpit. Our favorite colors, of course. Oh yeah. Non-whining. Non-skid stuff. You have no idea. We can't find this on this island. Hmm. Anywhere. That's why I had to order it on Amazon. But we have a specific use for it, so we had to bring that in. This, yeah, this is actually real wood veneer tape for edging all the new compartment pieces here. Oh, nice. So the top pieces and everything that are just done in plywood. This, of course, is all real teak, but underneath is plywood, so we have this to put on the edges. And it looks like we got some... What's that? Lights. Oh, chargers. Is it chargers? I have no idea. <laughs> oh, yeah, these are the phone chargers. Okay. Yeah, you got rid of the packaging. I just didn't recognize it. Yeah, nice. Just like the one I got over at my desk now. Works very well. And this is... Grow lights. Yes. We have all new grow lights to test all over the boat because we're going to put some over here and some over here, some in there, and especially some right under here. This is going to be where we're going to grow our new gardens, small gardens, inside gardens. Right? Yeah. And hopefully these are going to make them work really, really well. And from Mantis Marine. Beautiful. Nice. Another one of our favorite lights. And a spare filter cartridge for the new dive compressor. Thank you, Mantis Marine. We love you. <laughs> but yeah, this is my favorite barbecue light right there. It's a one inch clamp rail mount. You can clamp it anywhere in the boat. It's battery operated. It lasts like 48 hours on, you know, the average brightness, but uh, very good light. We've had the other one two years, so I figure it must be getting close to wearing out. So we wanted to get another one. And what do we got there? And that's a controller, looks like. Oh, yeah, that's a controller for one of the light systems. Cool. Okay, then we got the Wi-Fi's here. Yeah, that's another set of the grow lights. Okay. So I brought in two different sets so we can try them, see which one works better. And notice this is output 24 volts, so I can obsolete that almost instantly because our new battery system is 24 volts, so I can plug it all in direct. Works in theory. <laughs> yeah, now we're, we're going to test it in practical. Right? We got the 
The bad boy. Okay. Next solar controller. Yeah, you guys might remember we had some issues with some of our solar controllers after the, the lightning strike. So Battleborn had replaced one and now we got a replacement for the second one just in case. So thank you very much Battleborn, we appreciate it. And it's gonna be great to have all this worked out before we head into Pacific. So that's gonna help us get our system up and running top notch. So the rest of this, I ordered some additional vacuum bags for another project I've got in mind. We're probably not gonna tackle it until we actually get to Panama, but I've got something in mind that you guys are gonna get a kick out of, I'm sure. But that's what these big vacuum bags are for. We'll leave that for another story. Yeah, uh, man, he's possible. Miss Madeleine, wow, that thing's heavy, man. <laughs> <laughs> you hit somebody with that, they're gonna knock out for sure. Yeah, this is Maddie's pasta maker, you remember from the video previously? So yeah. Maddie wanted to get her own. <laughs> Part of and it, here part it is. Of it. <laughs> part of nice. It. It's right here. <laughs> it's heavy. It's heavy. <laughs> that's, like, that's it. That's it. No, the other parts in my suitcase. <laughs> it's the big part. I had to disperse the weight. That piece alone weighs like six pounds. Thank you so much. Thanks. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, is that the small pieces of vinyl? Yeah. So this yeah, is our new definitely. window material. Oh, nice. This stuff, I'm sure some of you guys have noticed that our Dodger windows are getting toasted very fast. They're almost dead. They're very fogged up. We've tried cleaning them, polishing them and everything. They clean up a little bit, but they've already become brittle. So we brought in several rolls of this stuff. Now that we have the ultimate upholsterer right at hand here, and you see we have all our stuff just been redone on the boat. And Jorge has agreed to do all of our windows in the Dodger, so, but we couldn't get the material that we needed here, so thank you very much to Mr. Boyd, we salute you, for bringing this down from the States. This all came from sale, right? And it's very, very good, high quality window material for our Dodger and the Bimini windows. So that will be installed before we leave also. Yeah, we hope. we got a few more pieces I'll bring out in just a second. Oh, no worries. Thank you, Mr. Boyd. Yeah, Anytime. Anytime. We love you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alright, I got it. Yeah. That's the uh, power control you're replacing? Yes, sir. Yeah, the 100 amp smart controller. So we just got a new version. It's got all new VE direct cable connectors right here. So it can be plugged directly into the network multiple ways and communicate with more equipment. And with these, I'm actually gonna be able to connect it into my Ray Marine system as well. So I'll be able to repeat all the information even on my displays up in the cockpit. So I can monitor stuff from up there when we're sailing. You can see where one of these angle screwdrivers comes in very handy someday. Very handy device. Reversing ratchet. Good for tight spaces like right here. Look up my positives. You see the lights come to life as it gets power. Last but not least, our charging cable. Plug in our VD, VE direct cable. That connect it to the network for now. And then we'll bring it up on the app and see if it shows up. And now we've got smart solar with a miscellaneous serial number, so that is our new controller. Set for 24 volts, automatic, that's good. Absorption voltage at 14.4, and that should be 29.2. Back to large panels. So I've just got my solar panels separated into two banks, large panels and small panels. You can see we're getting 485, 490, 500 watts there now, which is pretty good. It's only quarter to nine in the morning, 600 watts. Stronger the sun comes out. 
Mm -hmm. It's pretty good for before 9 o'clock. All right, so we're back in business with the new smart controller. And now we've got new methods of hooking them all up into the VE bus direct. So I'll look into that, and then we'll be able to connect the whole system to our Raymarine system when we plug it all together. So that's good. I'll be able to repeat all this information on all my displays anywhere without having to actually just log into an app. Muy bien. You want to inspect this? You want to come up here and inspect this? Make sure I did it right. Well, I have a confidence in you, you know. I'm not. Well, I'm finishing up right now. I asked you. You know, I I have a little vertigo when I go up. I'm ready. I'm afraid of heights. I forgot to show you that. Oh, we have a lot of nice water. Better. It's a lot better. Really good. Oh, doggone. This is spot. Hold on. Okay, you wait up here. I'll pass you the wax. <laughs> Oh, now he's gone. Ah, coming. Got it. Another gringo. Uh oh. Cool, man. They probably saw the half naked girl on the deck and said, oh, let's go there. <laughs> Hey man. Oh, hey, how's it going? Good, you alright? Yeah, I had a Juno 37 myself. Nice, yeah. I've um, been living on this one 15 years. Yeah, it's looking good. Um, you said you work from the boat? See? With internet? Yeah. What kind of internet? Claro. Uh, just the 4G? Yeah, Claro 4G. Uh, okay. Download's not so good, upload's okay. Okay. But it works, keeps us in business. Yeah. <laughs> okay, you're gonna have to tell me about Francesco again. Oh, you have to be very careful with Francesco because when he takes you into the jungle, this is where you find all of the very, very unusual uh, species of, of uh, Italian that comes out of him 
Bad humans. Yeah. <laughs> but you free, you used to live in Portobello. I used to live in Portobello, and I ran a restaurant there called Captain Jack's. I no was way. With, uh, Jack on that. Excellent. Well, we're going to be there next month for sure, so we'll definitely say hi. Well, t- say hi to my friends in Portobello. They're we will. And tell them who? Jeff and Jeff, Carolina. Jeff and Carolina. Yep. We will pass that along for sure. Hey, nice to meet you guys. Hey, don't you be jumping overboard again. <laughs> no worries. Oh, I know you, because Francesco showed me a lot of pictures of your yeah. boat. Yeah, he always told me about that. Yeah. Oh, great. Yeah. I think so now when we come back, I think so he's happy to know this. Yes. Oh. Small world. The world, yeah, the world is very little. Small world. <laughs> Orlando neighbors. Uh huh. Yeah, that's crazy. You got to meet Orlando Rick. <laughs> Captain Jack, Captain. That's Rick. Orlando Jeff. Uh huh. How's it going, guys? Great, yeah, actually. Uh, I mean, looking almost, good. Yeah, I got rid of the gray. A couple little gray spots. Maybe. Nice. Good, really good. I think I never met anyone from Orlando. Yeah, the rails and are looking good. And now I've met two. Like, <laughs> like same day. day. Yeah. <laughs> what the odds? <laughs> rails are looking perfect. And we don't have our Mickey Ready for Mouse hands. <laughs> <laughs> and somebody going home. Ciao, ciao. He's done a good job on that. That's really good. Look at this. So nice. Uh-huh. <laughs> that was in the British Virgin Island. Oh, What's up? What's up? Cooking some, some good food there. I some hope pad so. thai. Some chicken pad thai. I hope it turns out all right. I've cut about 700 vegetables for it. <laughs> it will be fine. It will be delicious. Nice. Sesame oil. Very light. Two yeah. tablespoons. They shave too much weight. Things break. One. Oh, always looks good. Yeah. At the boat show. Two. Yeah. <laughs> you put it in the water. Two tablespoons. Add two tablespoons of sriracha. <laughs> you can make it three, probably. Why? Just for a little extra Cause, sriracha. Because everyone likes sriracha. Uh-huh. You've had plenty of bad time. So you'll be the judge. <laughs> no worries. You can't make bad time. <laughs> no, it's delicious. Peanut butter. It's all about <laughs> peanut butter. <laughs> Wait, why did you live in Thailand? Oh, I was in the Air Force. <laughs> we were uh, bombing uh, Vietnam. <laughs> <laughs> This was ocho años sin pagarla. Sí, solo que te fue. Eh, pienso que vamos esperando que Alice sea un poquito más experto. Sí, 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 no, por supuesto, sí. Pero sí. Uh, in case you haven't figured out, we ah, have new okay. guests visiting from one of the neighboring boats, and they have arrived from Chile. Chile. The north Hello. Of Chile. Hola. Hola. <laughs> I'll let Madalena explain because she knows more about where they're from, but they sailed here from Chile not too long ago yeah. via Galapagos and Panama. They are the first time in a Caribbean side uh, for Discover and uh, I very enjoyed to stay in San Andres for some week. I think so like us. Everybody loves this island. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and. Uh, we, we start to speak in, they follow us uh, from Chile with a lot of friends, a lot of uh, more captains. This uh, surprise us, and especially Eric, I think so, because they are from Latin America, they don't know very well the English, and... It's great to know we got people watching even in Chile yeah, now, they I They are never very happy, <laughs> then uh, they have a... Spanish I guess that means. Now, yeah, Brendan's Spanish. translations are working. Good job, yeah. Brendan. <laughs> <laughs> My son Brendan, happy. he's been doing all the Spanish, Italian, everything yeah. translations on the video. Yeah, now. they are happy. And Barbara uh, explained to me because sometimes you see the video when you watch it, it's very hard uh, try to understand. Some 
use some when you watch it you understand something but not at all and it's very hard uh, to try to translate en la mente, en inglés, sí. En el, en lo escuchas en inglés, exacto, escuchas yeah. en inglés, lo traduces y cuando ya lo vas a decir, ya están en otro tema. Sí. Yeah. Ya pasó ese tema, when ya. Cuando you translate in your mind what you speaking, doing sí. the video, just uh, you move in another, another conversation. <laughs> in another conversation or in another place and it's very, it's very hard. They are very happy about this title. Yeah, that's good. No, I'm, I'm happy that you know, people are actually finding the videos in South America. I was wondering how long it would take if we could get people, because I kept people would send me uh, what do you call it, like the messages, yeah. Yeah. comments all the time. When are you going to subtitle these? When are you? Going? Jeez, like I need another job, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Too much stress. It's a big job, but no, luckily my son Brendan, he was like, I don't know how to do that, I don't know, but he finally figured it out and learned, and now he's just been doing it, so within about two days, I think two days, every video is subtitled in like five languages now. Oh. No, Italy. Italy. <laughs> Italian. Yeah. Italian too? Oh yeah, Italian's right there. Yeah, Spanish, French, and Italian, and then we do Portuguese, and, and uh, German. Uh, because Germany, surprisingly, is one of our biggest audiences. I see. And they don't have an uh, C, but uh, yeah. That's why they're better. <laughs> <laughs> so, salute Germany. Thank you for watching. <laughs> oh, it's, uh, I need to speak with my parents because they are so happy about that. Well, yeah, we started working harder on it when Madeleine was on board because I realized they couldn't watch the videos, they didn't, couldn't understand. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Allow for a five minute natural pressure release. Yeah, which which is that one? You think that'll take you five minutes? <laughs> I think you're just supposed to leave it for five. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Now you're done. Yeah. <laughs> Bam! <laughs> Wait. Here, just let it I think just let it sit for five minutes. Yes, you can also learn how to cook my telephone. <laughs> what did we ever do before Google? <laughs> yeah. Just Peanut butter. Right? What did we ever do before Google? <laughs> it looks nice. I don't know if I can do a chopstick. Oh, wow. wow. Do I detect dinner is served? Yeah, we have a. Uh, wow. The guys, this night, cook a. Uh, uh, pad thai. Pad thai. Is a Thailand food mm -hmm. <laughs> dish. Rob's favorite. Yeah, we've been yeah. smelling it. It smells yummy. <laughs> yeah, very delicious. Mm, we good. have a Thai evening today. And chopsticks. Wow, look at the table. Done up oriental stuff. Love it. <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. Sure. Yes, I our been working pleasure. for hours at this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, actually. <laughs> well, we appreciate it. I'm sure it's going to taste as good as it smells. <laughs> you can never uh, spoil <laughs> Me too. I think Rick's just thinking, just shut the damn camera off so we can eat. <laughs> yeah, before they record. Never, yeah. I would never say something like sure. that. <laughs> Alright, we ready? Pretty cool. Yeah. I'm ready to yeah. struggle with these chopsticks. <laughs> Yeah.
Terry. <laughs> Ciao, man. <laughs> Well, it was a good era, but it had to end because, as you guys know, the horizon is calling. So on we go. <laughs>